groups of people when it comes to podcasts. The person who has a podcast to spread conspiracies. We're our listeners, so after quite a lot of negotiation, I think we've discovered that the Philosopher's Stone is, in fact, Voldemort's testicle. The right one. Michael, you know where the tin foil went? The person who listens to sport podcasts. Hey, she's open. Who's open? The person who's listening to a dirty podcast in a public place. The person who just has a podcast to gossip about others. Oh my god, listeners, so you wouldn't believe this. Today, Morgan walks in with the most ugliest purple top I've ever seen. Just made it look so top heavy, just disgusting on her. That was a bit mean. I thought we were talking about Christy today. It's not mean, Morgan, it's a podcast. The person who listens to old podcasts. Oh my god. Zane left One Direction. The person who doesn't understand podcasts. Hey, I, I can't have a little, like, functions. That's what I wanted to do for my 21st. Can't do that anymore. Um, Mum called up a place. Or... The person who makes a video about podcasts to subtly hint that they have a podcast. The person who listens to Christian podcasts. Like said last week, uh, the Bible is quite literally a rule book to life. So back to the story. So that's when Jesus said, thou shall not steal. Okay, and that's when everyone started to realise that taking from others is in fact a sin. And the virgin who listens to sex advice podcasts. I found this on the web for hot tingly feeling in lower region. The person that's still on SoundCloud. Hey guys. Guys. The person who doesn't understand podcast part two. Hey guys, check out this picture. Wait. The person who thinks they've discovered podcasts. What? Oh, no, no, no. I, I don't listen to music. I listen to social commentary. Hello and welcome to Johnny Knows Best, because Johnny knows best and his mummy told him so. A big hello to our top Patreon mummy, and coming in quick... Johnny. The person who listens to murder cases at night. Emily had been missing for two weeks now. The police found a bloodied knife in the boyfriend's car. A lot of people who get out alive say that murderers are sometimes some of the nicest people when you meet them. Hey, Alan, then... just put the kettle on. You want a cup of tea? No. Uh, no, thank you. What? What did I do? The creep. Hi there. So, in today's podcast, I will be sniffing my right foot and then describing to you in exquisite detail what it smells like. So guys, today it smelt a bit like a troubled childhood with a tinge of unwashed Shane Dawson. Hi guys! So as a lot of you may have guessed, my sister and I have made a podcast! Yeah! That's right, my sister Lily and I have created a Spotify original podcast called Gee Thanks. <laughs> and I'm really, really excited for you guys to have a listen. <laughs> As we talk about a lot of things that we don't talk about here on YouTube. Why don't we start with two truths and a lie? Well, mine was, okay, here's my two truths and a lie. A lot of things that we can't talk about here on YouTube. A lot of juicy gossip, hot topics and opinions. And we also share some really funny stories. There'll be a new episode dropping every Wednesday. And if you want to be featured in the podcast, you can send your questions in to gthanks at thisisamplified.com. You can record your question on your phone, send it through and we'll put you in the podcast. And you can even send us ideas for future episodes or suggest guests that you might like to see on the podcast. The first episode of G Thanks is out now. There'll be brand new weekly episodes on Wednesdays. Click the link in my bio to go follow and listen. <laughs> like a troubled childhood with a tinge of unwashed Shane Dawson. <laughs>